hello students now i have started making the videos in english also because the students were demanding that uh, please make video for in english also so now i am starting so here you will see that all questions i am just uploading separately so that you can go on the channel and you can watch whichever question you want to see at the time right students in this question paper you will see that questions are concept based so your concept should be very clear you should read the ncert properly because all the questions are from ncert right so how the question has to be understand and how the answer should be done that you will understand by this these videos which i am making and i will make the video separately of each question now here i am starting the first question question is a single displacement reaction is represented below pq plus r gives pr plus q this is a displacement reaction given here you know what is the displacement reaction in chapter first that is chemical reaction and equations as well as in metals non metal also you have done this reaction displacement reaction is what displacement reaction is a reaction in which a more reactive metal a more reactive metal displaces to a less reactive metal displaces a less reactive metal this you have done right you have done it in case of metal that is well i am mentioning here metal so here the reaction is given that is pq plus r gives p r plus q and in this reaction if i write the reaction here the reaction is pq plus r gives p r plus q ab here in p r what is metal p is metal you know that always when ionic compound is formed the left hand ion is of metal and is positively charged always is cation always and on right hand side it is non metal and it is always an anion or negative charged ion you can say so means here metal is not displaced or metal is not displacing means r is not a metal because pq is changed uh, pq changes to pr so if pq changes to pr means r takes a place of q right and q is separated and it forms pr so r is what r is an anion how can you say it is an anion because if it forms pr means here p is positive charge and r is negative so r is what it is an anion right so here the question is which of the following is true about the reactants and the products so you see here options nature of r in product and stability of pr as compared to pq is given first option a says it r is a cation no r is an anion this we have seen so a option is wrong here b also says it is a cation this is again is wrong now two options are left c and d so both have an anion so now we are going to the second column where it is written that stability of pr as compared to pq what do you think children you can comment in the comment box according to you which is more stable pq or pr always remember because pr is formed as a product and pq is the reactant where r takes the place of q means if r can change pq into pr means pr is more stable than pq because pq is not very stable that is why r could displace q from pq understood so we can write here that pr is more stable than pq why because now q is less reactive means what that r is more reactive element than q you can say so here it is not like that always the metal which is more reactive can displace the less reactive metal any any element 
एनी एलिमेंट विच इज मोर रिएक्टिव ठीक है विच इज मोर रिएक्टिव और यू कैन से मोर रिएक्टिव एलिमेंट कैन डिस्प्लेस द लेस रिएक्टिव एलिमेंट राइट से हेयर इट इज नॉट अ केस ऑफ मेटल इट इज अ केस ऑफ सिंपली एन एलिमेंट दैट आर इज मोर रिएक्टिव एंड इट डिस्प्लेस इज क्यू विच इज लेस रिएक्टिव अंडरस्टूड सो हेयर विच ऑप्शन विल बी करेक्ट सी एन आइन यस एंड स्टेबिलिटी इफ वी सी मोर स्टेबल सो हेयर द सी ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट D is wrong because here it is written less stable, which is wrong here, right? So how we can say it is more reactive? Because R could take place of Q because R is more reactive than Q and forms P R, whereas Q, which is now left here, Q cannot displace R. So R P R is more stable. I hope you understood it well. We'll meet in the second video of second question. Thank you for watching Achievers Academy.